It's been said that love conquers all. We'll see how that works out for a Nashua couple when one of them <laughs> is celebrating after the Super Bowl. Well, you see, the wife is a diehard Patriots fan, but the man she married is an Eagles fan. WBZ's David Robichaux has their story. When Cassie Greco married Sean Hennessy two years ago, they promised to be true to each other in good times and bad. After Super Bowl Sunday, one of them will have a really good time. The other, not so much. This is our Christmas card for this year. Cassie is a Pat's season ticket holder. Her hubby was raised an Eagles fan. We can't really talk anything football at this point. <laughs> at their wedding, the bride's father, Jimmy, roasted Sean a bit about his main competition for Cassie's affection, Tom Brady. So now, Sean, you're going to hear this an awful lot. You're just jealous of Tom Brady. The couple met when they were both freshmen at Penn State. I started dating end of our junior year, so uh, Penn State's the one football team we can agree on. In their Nashua apartment, there's a Brady for President sign next to an autographed Eagles helmet. The Bud Light Super Bowl beer cans sit opposite a Philly hat. The Eagles, another Chip Kelly thing signed. Does it hurt when you touch that? Uh, yeah, it burned a little bit. <laughs> she tries to keep it even for me because if she starts putting out too many Pats things, she knows things will end up in the trash. Now they can't believe their favorite teams are going head-to-head -to, -head to win it all. And when we found out, we wouldn't let him back into the bedroom. My uncle texted me. He's like, hey, if you need to place a crash for two weeks, let me know. <laughs> Sean will travel home to Pennsylvania to watch the game. Cassie will be at her parents' home in Groton. All right, see, see ya. ya. No matter who comes out on top on Sunday, there will be no finger pointing in this household. After all, Sean and Cassie say family will always be number one. And it's no accident that I'm using this hand, Sean. Sorry. In Nashua, David Robichaux, WBZ News.